Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I will be showing you how to remove breakpoints from your website in Webflow. So yeah guys, make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly. So you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead to the official webflow.com website right here and log into your account. And after logging into your account, guys, you'll be greeted by this main page right here where you can see all the websites that you have already created, as you can see. So, guys, the first thing you have to do to be able to remove breakpoints is the following. You want to go ahead and download this extension for Chrome called FinSuite extension for Webflow. This is a great extension that will allow you to remove breakpoints because Webflow does not allow you by itself to remove breakpoints, so you will have to use this extension right here. So what you can do after installing the extensions, go back to Webflow and now we can go ahead and open up our website. By clicking on right here and opening up the designer, you will see now this will open up our website in the page. As you can see at the left side of the screen are all the options that we need for managing our website and all the elements. We have our components, we can add new elements and so on. As you can see here guys, now there is one extra option under settings right here that appears which is the Fins Read extension. Let's go ahead guys and click on it. As you can see, I have created a, a breakpoint right here that I want to remove. Go ahead and click on the Fins Read extension on the left side of the screen and now this will open up this new menu with multiple options. And you can see you have multiple options that you can choose but we want to select candies and in candies guys this will now once again open up uh, our uh, options that we can use and as you can see here guys one of them is called breakpoints right here go ahead guys and open up breakpoints as you can see now we have the option to remove breakpoints so what we can do is find the breakpoint that we want to remove and click the delete button right here as you can see remove breakpoint i'm i'm ready and as you can see guys, now this will remove the breakpoint from our website and it will no longer appear on our, our website when we are editing the website and uh, making it uh, however we want it to be. But yeah guys, basically as you can see, we have successfully removed the breakpoint. So yeah guys, that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So yeah guys, thank you for watching, take care and bye.